The Site Menu feature helps you add navigation to your website. To add a site menu, drag and drop the site menu element onto your page. If you position the site menu in your site header, it will automatically sync across all pages where your site header is visible. To add links to your site menu, click on Edit Menu Links. You can create a link to one of your pages, a section or anchor link within a page, an email address, another website, a phone number, or a menu title which is often used to activate a drop-down menu. By hovering over a link, you will notice the Edit and Remove buttons appear. To create a drop-down menu that expands when hovered, click the right arrow besides the links you'd like to include. You can add several links to a drop-down menu. The top-level link, or menu title, will activate the drop-down menu. Here's what this looks like on a live page. You can style your site menu through the editing menu. You can change the font, menu style, colors, and functionality. To adjust the appearance and functionality of your site menu on smaller devices, switch to the Mobile Layout Builder. By default, your site menu will appear as a hamburger icon. You can position and style it however you want. The Section Browser gives you access to several pre-styled header sections that include site menus. This can be a great way to get started quickly when designing a new site. Once you've added a header section, you can click on Make Header Section so it changes on all the pages where your site header is visible. If you don't want your header to appear on any given page, click the drop-down menu and then select Hide. You will need to hide your section on desktop and mobile versions of your page.